Hey everybody, it's Faith from Firesign Tarot. One more time, last time for the day, Libra, you will close the November set. Throw them down for you. This reading will be for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for November 2021. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with a message given by the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it's your journey, not mine. I'm just throwing down cards. If it doesn't resonate, hey, that's okay too. You can check your Moon, Rising, and Venus sign readings if you think you might want something that might resonate a little bit better. Keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. All things can be vice versa. Might even play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. Our good friends, the cross watchers are always welcome here at the fire sign tarot table. Everybody's always welcome at my table. I appreciate everybody stopping by to say hi. If you're new here, I think we might vibe and get along and stuff. You can hit the subscribe button and the notification bell if you want to come back and visit me some more. If you're returning, welcome back. Where the hell you been? Put on some coffee. Go grab a cup. I'm going to throw down some cards. Have a good time. Anybody can hit the like button at any time. It all helps the channel. It is all greatly appreciated. And it helps the messages to be circulated to those who might need them. So, two quick things before I invoke the cards and throw them down for you. Libra 1, never make a life-altering decision based on a tarot reading. I don't care if they're my cards or somebody else's. And two, if it is not your reading, not your story, not your message, if it's not vibing with you in any way, shape, or form, it's not making sense in your life, if it doesn't fit, don't try to force it, take with you only what belongs to you, leave the rest, it may not have been meant for you. Okay, feeling one more good shuffle. Yep, okay. I think they're ready. All right, tip them down. Heavenly Father, Mother, Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guide to Archangels, I ask for any messages you have for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Thanks for coming down and hanging out with me today. I appreciate you. I'm grateful and thankful for this gift that I've been given, and I ask that you help me use it to clearly and accurately bring Libra to their highest possible spiritual good, put them on their highest possible spiritual path. Libra, what's up? Seven of Swords reversed. Well... Seven Pentacles. Hmm. Coming clean about something, but it's all about timing, isn't it? Okay. Well. King of Cups, Queen of Wands. I'm not saying anything yet. Why is it happening? Oh, shit. Yup. Okay. Oh, Libra. Oh, Libra. You know what? Now is a hell of a time to figure out what you want and start going after it. In the past, we have the King of Cups. He is not someone who wears his heart out on his sleeve. Insert whatever pronoun works for you. I'm just talking about the depiction of the card, okay? It's a king. It's a dude. <sighs> Emotions are there, but they're not necessarily expressed. The queen of wands, which is your present energy, knows what she wants and goes after it hell or high water all in both barrels. I think it took you a minute to figure it out, and here's why. Eight of Swords, Nine of Cups reversed, Seven of Wands reversed. You had issues with inner demons, self-defeating thoughts, all that happy horse shit. 
you weren't you weren't one within yourself. You weren't happy within yourself. You weren't at peace within yourself, and you got all wrapped up in self defeating thoughts. It like puts you in a fucking cage, bro. Seriously. You knew what you wanted. You knew what you felt. I don't think you expressed it very well. Uh, I got a page of cups reversed in the immediate future. Timing, 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 timing. Okay. Timing, timing, timing. Ace of Swords reversed. Yeah. Didn't say it. Didn't say it. One of the Queen of Wands. One, oh, 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 oh. It hit the floor. It must be important. Swing and a miss. Swing and a miss. Why? Hi. Ten of Pentacles reversed. Fighting against the wind. Why the Ten of Pentacles reversed? Why is that reversed? Ten of Cups. <clears throat> can't offer you much, but I can offer you happiness. You're fighting against the wind. It may be too little too late to come in with this offer. Because I feel like it's going to be rejected. I feel like the emotions have been there and they've been there for a while, but you couldn't say anything. For whatever reason, you kept it quiet. You bided your time. <sighs> Why the page of cups reversed? Pentacles, really. Page of Swords reversed. I don't like two upside down pages. That means you're going to sit on it and not say anything. Because you feel like you're fighting against the wind. You feel like you can't offer him much. You feel like at this moment it's not going to connect. You feel like you waited too long. Ace of Wands reversed. It's not going to kick off. It's not going to kick off. You wrapped up. You wrapped up in it for too long. Okay, I'm not gonna address that right now. We're not gonna address that. <sighs> Give me two seconds. Sorry, I had to address it. It was work. Yeah. Um. I think it's like self-defeating thoughts that could prevent this. All right. Libra, hit me one time. Universe one time. Empress, this has potential for growth. The potential is there. I feel like you're not going to say anything because you don't think it's there because of all the self-defeating thoughts and bullshit. There's potential here for growth. So, dear friends, get to make up your mind. You want to! You want to so bad! But I feel like you're not gonna. Go for it. Why the fuck not? Can I get one of this Queen of Cups, please? I 
I think the outcome in the make or break here, um, you have so much love to give and you have so much to offer. You are a catch and you need to see yourself as that. But your anxiety issues are going to get the best of you. Don't ever think this. You're a fucking catch, Libra. You are. You may not see it, but you are. You need to not overthink this. One more. One more. One more. Ah! Justice reversed. Seven of Cups reversed. You need to find balance within yourself. Your self-defeating thoughts are only causing the universe confusion. Seriously. The universe will, manif will give you anything you ask for, but you have to ask for it. If you're filling the universe with your self-defeating thoughts, it's going to give you what you want. Because that's what it thinks you want. It thinks it, that you don't want it to work out because that's what you're telling it. Do you understand that? Do you understand that? If you put yourself in a mindset, this can grow, this can work out, I'm going to go for it, it'll work. If you keep yourself in the mindset of, I'm not good enough, I don't have enough to offer, it's not going to work. It's what you put out there. It's not just verbally. It's your thoughts and your feelings. It's what's on your head and your heart. Not just what comes out of your mouth. It's four swords of earth. Stop being so damn restless about it. Self-defeating thoughts come from past experiences. Comes from restless energy. Things that you never laid to rest. Things that you never processed and cut off. It's still with you. You just haven't processed that heartbreak yet. You're still restless about it. You haven't taken that fourth sword and cut it out and let it go. So what you need to do is process and let go. You're, you're in control of your own self-defeating thoughts, Libra. You're in control of your own chaos and your own confusion. <laughs> you can control this. You can. You just have to let yourself. I think this is going to be short, sweet, and to the fucking point. You're going to stand back and watch shit happen. You're going to make shit happen. What do you want? What do you want? You going to watch it slip away? You're going, to, you're going to make it be yours. Are you going to truly embrace the Queen of Wands energy? Or are you going to stay an upside down page? What do you want? What do you want? You the catch, baby. Be the catch. Embrace the catch. You got three queens on this table right now. Be the catch. Be the fucking empress, baby. You got it in you. Be the empress. Do it. Don't let... Don't get in your own way. Don't get in your own way. What's your advice? High Priestess in the Five of Cups. You know what you gotta do. You know what you gotta do. You gotta process this heartbreak. Allow yourself to be guided to what you want. Don't keep fighting it. Well, you're gonna be sitting there crying by the river tears forever. judgment reversed in the page of wands you gotta bury what you need to bury you gotta move forward just because judgments didn't go in your favor in the past doesn't mean you don't have a bright future ahead of you, you just go walk the path you gotta go for what you want
Four of Pentacles and the Page of Swords. Hold on to what you got to hold on to. Hold on to the experience. Hold on to the lesson that you're supposed to learn from it. Don't hold on to the pain. Don't hold on to the bad part of the experience. Learn to let that shit go. Speak truth. Think truth. If you, if you speak it, if you speak and think what you want, and you have that on your head and your heart, you will manifest it. But you got to speak it. You can't hold it in. You got to say what you want. You got to know what you want. You got to go after it. If you keep yourself in these self-defeating thoughts, you're not going to get anywhere. Two of Pentacles. Embrace the change. It's coming. But that change has to start within you and your mindset. Find balance. There's a healthy balance with keeping the lessons of past experiences and keeping the pain. Don't hold on to the pain. Cut that out and regain balance. Okay, Libra, this has been your reading, loves. I hope it helped someone. Oh my gosh, I'm like sliding notifications. Have one hell of a November. Thanks for coming down. I will be here in a couple of weeks with your November round two. Thanks for stopping by. Know that you're loved. Be blessed. I send you off with love and light. Catch you next time.